You see it. Let us get it popping. Guess who's back? Still smoking on my clothes, ladies and gentlemen. This is part two to Bobby Tarantino 2. Um, last time we left off on uh, Yuck, which is the Joyner Lucas diss track. It is, it is, it is. It is. If nobody said it, I'm saying it now. This is the response, and I respect him for it. I'm gonna do a whole video for that, but right now, we are number six, Indica Bud, I mean Badu, featuring Wiz Khalif. Ready, set, go. Okay. Logic smoking now, so I you know you gotta get on this track. Everybody know I be, everybody know I be. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I didn't know it was gonna jump like that. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna keep it a stack. Uh, this is not what I expect from Logic. I don't know if I like it or if I don't like it, but we're gonna get right back into it. Oh, my bad. That's Midnight. Why did it start playing Midnight? My bad. Let's play Indica Badu. Featuring this. Why does it keep doing that? Alright, Indica Badu, here we go. Jim Wiz. Hey. Oh. Smoking, I know. Rap about it. Let him know. You know what you want? What you want? I knew it's gonna be, it's gonna be a laid back, wavy. Hey. Ah. Jay Dilla right here. Oh, it's Dilla. Ah, it is. All right, get into the song for thirty seconds. Pocket fat like shoulders. A little bit more. Need temperature. Let's I want to the wheel, so. Smoking with, I mean, just started, and Wiz is a OG triple OG at it, so he kind of just, but his flow, he was buttery with it. Uh, number seven is Midnight, but we already did that. Uh, no, I'm tripping. Midnight started playing a little of it, but um, yeah. definitely can tell he's trying to get that trap logic sound. This don't sound like, I mean, I don't listen to a lot of logic, but from what I've heard, this kind of like sounds different. Um, this is definitely a different type of logic. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I just am listening to more logic. Uh, but I did listen to a logic full project. The one was like the Sinatra mixtape or whatever. I saw that one. Yeah, this one, you could definitely tell he trying to not be corny. And that's what, I feel like a lot of rappers who started out like the super riggedy raps and talking about how hip hop is messed up and Da, da, da. I think a lot of them are having like an existential crisis right now. Like Hobson's the same way. I think Hobson is the last thing they want to be called is corny. Which is fine because some of the stuff was corny. 
Where are we at? All right, cool. Damn, we're already five minutes. Good thing I cut into two, because if I would have made one, y'all, boy, boy. Anyway, uh, maybe I will just put this together as one and make one long video. I'll test that. Let me do, I'm going to do that. I'm going to, uh, y'all better watch every minute of this video because it probably took me two to a couple hours to edit it. All right. So number eight is Warm It Up featuring Young Sinatra. Huh? Is Young Sinatra a different person? Is that his ultra ego? Here we go. Yeah, we boom back. If I'm going to make this one video, I got to start speeding up though. Yeah. Oh, we only got three songs left. We got What's Up featuring Big Sean, State of Emergency. This is that old school, yeah? Okay. I knew he was gonna say that. Okay. Okay, my bad. I, I, got, I was letting that rock for too long. I'm only supposed to listen to a minute of each. <clears throat> I'm not trying to get flagged. Um, I like this one. I like this one. He was chopping. He was not playing around. You could tell. Uh, he's like, I need something for the for the core logic fans. And warm it up, feature Young Sinatra. He's smart for putting feature Young Sinatra. So his fans right away like the. Young Sinatra mixtape fans can look at it right there and go right to it. Uh, number nine, Wizard of Oz. You see where that? Uh, almost done. We only got two more after this. Um, their state of emergency featuring two chains. Of what's up? Then I'm gonna do the Yaku. Bitch, I've been running my city like I am. I don't do this shit for nothing but squad. Okay. Money and that money. Not everything sounds cool. So saying you run in your city like the Wizard of Oz, I mess with you, Logic, but Wizard of Oz just ain't cool to be running your city like. That's just, I mean like the, I mean like the Wicked Witch of the West. That's not a bar, but all right, let me go. The verdict's a lot on that. This beat is crazy. Hey. I like his flow too. Hey. Finger fuck all of them put back in my GED classes. I don't mean that's but I'm finna stun on their asses. Can you finna stun on their ass? For what I rap for the masses, from basses, it's song. All this other shit that's on now. Logic Scott. I forgot. I realize we're gonna get Logic Scott on this song. So y'all can feel the pain. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Uh, Alright, I was liking that until Logic Scott showed up. I'm not even saying that Logic using auto tune is whack, but here's my thing about auto tune. T Pain didn't have somebody to base his melodies and cadences off of. He did it by himself, and that's why there's like T Pain cadences. There's a way of T Pain auto tune. Like people disrespect auto tune, man. People act like auto tune is no. Auto tune is art. Auto tune is something that enhances your voice, but you got to be able to do something with it. Because just Travis Scott has his own type of auto tune. Travis Scott's delivery in auto tune is deep, which is different because a lot of people go high. Because it's easier when you're, you're, you're let me just break it down. When you're using auto tune, you kind of have to talk a little like this to get the best effect. But somehow Travis goes into lows, which is why I like Travis when he goes straight up. That shouldn't sound like that. You know what I mean? But. Don't do that anymore. No more logic, Scott. Find your find your auto tune bag, your pocket, and go in. I'm not saying you shouldn't use. I'm saying find your bag, shorty. Here we go. State of emergency. Then after this we got. I mean, featuring two chains. And after this we got what's up featuring Big Sean. Yeah. You don't let this rock. I hope my you know, cam don't die. Yeah. Two chains. I hope two chains yeah. go first. First, I want to hear. Get him. Oh, he said, 
the ironing. I used to iron jeans. I had a heavy crease. What? I love Two Chains. Listen, Two Chains can spit, but he's the king of the nonsensical bar. And that's not a bad thing. That's a style. That's the drunk monk style. ODB used to use that. You know what I mean? You would just say some wild stuff that makes someone laugh. It's just like, if you laughing, you... Here's the thing. Music's supposed to make you feel. So if someone says some nonsen nonsensical stuff to make you laugh and you laugh, he just created art. So don't don't lowbrow because it's, it's humor. Humor can be smart too. Here we go. My bad. I just had to get my bag for a second. The catastrophe, you know your majesty. So that's my catastrophe. That's such a tragedy. Murder like it's masterpiece. I don't ever want to hear people sleeping on Two Chains flow. I know everybody now after Chorus Septic is like remix is like, yo, Two Chains can spit. Two Chains been. I am smoking on that gas. Life should be on Cinemax. Come on, man. He's been spitting. Let's go. Mm. Mm. Okay. Mm. That was a little weird. That was a little weird. Slow down. Okay. 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 Okay, let's hear how about you can have rap. I'm a sit by war on fire. Mm. I'm trying to tell these, these rap you mother effers, man. Let me get into my bag. If you just rapping, you ain't blogging, you ain't on YouTube doing something, you ain't reaching to the fans every day, man, you losing. Hmm? Same 1997, bruh. They got to see your face every day. That's why, the, you know what I mean? The numbers going. You ain't gonna have to put the money behind it all the time to for you to get numbers. You can just get paid over this. I'm trying to let y'all know. I'm trying to give you, you know, some game for you know, free ninety nine. That's all I'm trying to do. But here we go. Right back, I do like that. Hey, you can't put Shout me in the box. My talent put me in the budget like the game with no expansion. Hey. Answer. I ain't in the club throwing dollars. All right, that's enough. Let's listen to What's Up featuring Big Sean, which is the last track, and Jesus. This has been a long one, so here we go. We're gonna get right into it. I just really wanna hear Big Sean's verse. Let's, let's see what this is. Last track, and I'll tell you how I feel about the whole project. You dig them. Then I'm gonna start recording the yuck breakdowns. I'm like, what's up? Where you been? What you know about? Who let them in? I'm a show for now. Who's really down? They're just coming out. Really down. I'm gonna chop it up. I'm going first, I bet you. Okay. I have seen Vader wearing all white. It was a Comic Con, don't ask me, but okay. Yeah, young nigga that's trying to innovate. I've been in waste. You niggas hold up, don't get no closer. Big sweet and closer. Hi, power shows. Yeah, you get this year's closer. Straight. Uh, so blessed, hope I'm performing Sunday. So it's time to logic. Instant classic. Like, what's up, man? 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 What's up, Okay. Get it, boy, he keep it real. Chop up. You building up to a punch on the hair. Try to get He said, call me sire like Jaden. That's the power of will. <laughs> we will stop right there. All right, here's how I feel about it. Last two songs we've already heard every day, 44 more. Um, haven't ever listened to a full, this is my first time listening to a project, Logic tape all the way through, and I didn't listen to it all the way through, I just listened to snippets of it, so my first reaction would be that. Uh, I think Logic fans, I don't know how they're gonna feel about this one, because I think the diehard fans may be like, nah, they're gonna like it, they're gonna like it. It's Bobby Tarantino too. it's got a good brand name. 
Um, the brand is already trusted by his fans, so Bobby Tarantino too is gonna have, uh, you know, value to them. Um, for me, from what I thought logic was to hearing this, even after 44 stuff, it's a little bit more trappy than I thought it'd be, which is fine. The beats you choose to get on are not bad, but he's definitely flexing on this one. He has a lot of contradicting statements where, you know, he talks about rappers flexing and then he flexes. And I feel like every time he says something about flexing, he always goes, and this is not a rapper flex. Yes, yes it is. It's okay. It's okay to flex. I don't understand why you want, you clearly want it. This is, and that's not just a lie, this is all conscious rappers. It's like, you, every human, do we have to pretend like we don't understand why we like flexing or why we like doing that stuff? Like, yeah, we, I'm, I'm a lyricist and I'm going to say like, but I make, turn up music to it but it's like so we don't act like we don't understand that because it always seems like rappers like that will do something like oh i'm ironically gonna make a, like hops i'm gonna ironically make a bumble rap song and then it ends up being hot and it's like you could have just made us i mean i know what you're it's, it's fine it's it's okay you might be a really good mumble right you might be a good it's about the vibe bro and i think what happens is People put that on this type of pedestal and put the other stuff on this type of pedestal and don't realize both of those need talent. Yeah, I said it. Both of them need talent for them to be good. So, yeah, it was a cool, cool little project. Um, I think a lot of fans are going to like it. Um, I don't know how much I'm going to go back and revisit this. Um, I'm, really I'm really excited to hear what Anthony Fantano and Sean C. have to say about this. If uh, you don't know who those are, I don't, I mean, you're lying to yourself. You know who they are. But yeah, um, I give it a uh, out of 10. <laughs> like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you listen to that yuck breakdown because that's going to be fun. My name is Screw. I'm pretty freaking awesome. I love you. Thank you for everything. Make sure you go support my single, No Way. New music coming soon. And we are face.